It's the largest project in University of Wisconsin River Falls history. They broke ground this week on a $117 million science and technology innovation center. Joe Mason looks at the project. You can say it has curb appeal. Living here in Hudson in his dream house, people tell Jeff Cernhaus he's lucky. I would say that it was a lot of hard work. But the more Jeff worked, the luckier he got. It was a lot of perseverance. There's certainly always some luck. After graduating from University of Wisconsin River Falls with his wife Christy three decades ago, Jeff built several companies. Now the two are helping build a new future for students on their old campus. We both firmly believe in giving back locally. The couple donated more than a million dollars for the university's science and technology innovation center called SciTech. We really were trying to thoughtfully create opportunities for future Jeff and Christy Cerna houses. The $117 million building is a landmark project for the school. This is the largest building project in the history of UW River Falls. Chancellor Maria Gallo tells us SciTech will be home to students who will learn through hands-on experiences. The project will create partnerships between the university and businesses, providing students with valuable research opportunities and jobs while growing the economy. I hope it's a really good collaborative space. That's what I'm looking for in a, in a, in a, a space for incubation of ideas. If all goes well with construction on this project, the SciTech building should open to students in a few years. Christy and I are just happy we could contribute in some way. Living here is a long way from the dairy farms Jeff and his wife grew up on. A true success story students on campus can follow with a little luck and a lot of hard work. Joe Mason, 5 Eyewitness News.